Did you know that some fungi, bacteria, and even insect larvae can actually break down plastic, and in some cases, even eat it? One famous example is a bacterium called Edionella sakaiensis, discovered in Japan. This microbe produces two enzymes, P-tase and m tase that can break apart the chemical bonds of pet plastic, the same type commonly used in drink bottles. It's not just microbes, though. Animals like waxworms and superworms have been shown to digest plastics, such as polystyrene, and fungi like Aspergillus tubingi can degrade polyurethane with the help of special enzymes that attack ester bonds. Now, you might wonder, why not just farm these organisms to get rid of our plastic waste? Well, it's not that simple. The process is extremely slow, and in the case of larvae, tiny plastic residues can remain inside their bodies. If these larvae end up in the natural food chain, that could create a whole new environmental problem. That's why scientists are still racing to engineer stronger enzymes and more efficient bacteria, hoping to turn biological plastic recycling into a real solution for the future.